set, maybe something was just out of position. So two of them got bypassed, and the motor just keeps on spinning. Then it's spinning, it's spinning. The timer that goes off will tell you, hey, this motor's been spinning too long. Go set an alarm. If it's spinning too long, a little bit longer so it doesn't mess nothing else up that could be damaged. The second timer will tell everything to shut off, stop working, do not do anything else till it's fixed. That's when you hit the e-stop, go fix whatever, reposition what needs to be done. Pull the e-stop back out, make sure they're all activated on point, and then I'll carry on to the next step. Then it'll repeat.